We need for you to pay attention for just a few moments, folks. Here she is, Sue, with some remarks. Quiet, please, quiet. Quiet. Wait, I know how to work this crowd. Shake it, but not mess it up. Okay, this is the tough part. 
Jim is here in spirit with all of us. He's my co-partner for all these years. Jim, what can I say? You've been my rock behind all the reunions and stood by me through all the good and bad. Being together as a team to all of the planning of all the appointments for the reunions, we have worked together for some 40 years and have grown into quite a friendship. Jim, you are my reunion husband, I'm your reunion wife. Everybody jumps around on that. The last three and a half months have been quite challenging for me, not having you by my side to help make all these decisions for our final touches. I miss our daily discussions on what was going on and our committed friendship that will last a lifetime of memories. I know I said this is my last reunion to do. After seeing all the joy of one another and the body relationships, I have decided only to rethink my decision. Years. Um, 
And but we're not done. I mean, as Sue said, the website's up for 20 more years. So we have a lot of opportunities and challenges ahead of us. And I think in you know, 10, 20 years, we'll all reminisce about um, how we navigated those opportunities. So it's great to see everybody. Uh, I don't want to get too wistful or, or philosophical, but um, you can't have a reunion without classmates. I mean, reunion is about reuniting and reconnecting and friendship. And uh, people have come from like all over the country. It's wonderful. I mean, people have traveled hundreds of miles, in some cases thousands of miles, to be here tonight. So I think we should give a big round of applause to each other. And it's just wonderful that everyone's here. And, and to be honest, you can't have a reunion. It's great. You right. have to have the last right. to be here. But, okay. But people have to do the hard work. And Sue, thank you so much. I mean, I mean, Sue, Sue's been wonderful. She's had a victory of Tim's illness. Sue has been phenomenal. And, and Sue, thank you, thank you, thank you for everybody here. Um, really, really appreciate it. And, Sue and thank her, her fantastic committee, but I wanted to recognize the current committee by name. So a lot of people put in a lot of effort um, to make this evening a success, and I think they, um, you know, should be recognized. I know Sue mentioned Val, the phenomenal website was put together by Val. So thank you, Val. She's not here, but thank you very much. And I just like to individually name the people they stood up before who are on the committee. And if I miss somebody, I'm sorry or mispronounce a name. I'm sorry, but here they are. Um, Kathy Glover Leone. Bill Fuller. Madeline Joseph. Um, Joanne Modio Vanola. Vanola. I mispronounced it. I'm sorry. But thanks, Joanne. Uh, Bob Tinslinger, yeah. Howard Willen, yeah. Marsha Master Alperin, yeah. Bonnie Myers, yeah. and Mike Stevens. Thank you. 
doing the entire committee for putting this party together. Give them a round of applause. Come on. Yeah. Well, folks, I'm going to give you an opportunity to relive your past right now. Michael will lead you through the culinary ice high experience, as it were. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Lander Haven. We're delighted to have you here on this very special occasion. We have food stations all over the place, and I'm sure they will reflect some of your younger days. We have Maupies at Royal Castle right over here. We're serving wings, we're serving sliders, we're serving french fries, we're serving coleslaw. Over here is Geraces, we got pizzas and pasta. Okay. 